You're listening to WJHS 91.5 The Eagle. Welcome to Media in the Making, a podcast where we look at the evolution of media from 1600 all the way to present day 2020. In this podcast series, you will learn how different forms of media have changed culture. Media in the Making, where media and culture are always changing. Now, let's take a step back in time. Modern society has the ability to access millions upon millions of pieces of information with the click of a few keys on a keyboard. If 20th century innovators were to see the capabilities of modern day web searching, they wouldn't be able to comprehend it. As someone who lives in today's modern technological society, can you imagine typing out a URL letter by letter to access a web page? Just think about it. Prior to 1998, you had to know the exact URL to be able to access a certain page of information. Now, there were some programs like Gopher and the World Wide Web Index Systems that served as libraries for hyperlinks and URLs, and there were even single-server search engines like Jughead. When 1998 came around, the publication of a new search engine rocked the world. This search engine was Google. In 1995, Larry Page and Sergey Brin two computer science students at Stanford, began to develop this new software. After a year passed, Google made its interweb debut on the Stanford campus. 1997 saw the establishment of Google's domain, and as another year of development passed, Google finally made its worldwide debut. Internet users were ecstatic with this new invention. The invention of Google made the internet more accessible and recognizable. One of Google's roles was to make the internet user-friendly so that the URL did not have to be memorized and entered manually. Users could plug in certain keywords to the search engine to find multiple websites and pages with the information they're looking for. Since the invention of Google's since the invention of the Google search engine, searching the internet could not be any more effortless. Google has given access to a plethora of information on any subject imaginable. Throughout the past couple of decades, Google has been programmed to now give researchers the most significant links with the most significant information. Along with this information prioritization, Google makes it easier for people to send and receive the biggest news stories from all around the world. The sharing of information has improved tenfold with the Google search engine's abilities, compared to the times when information took hours or days to spread with the newspaper, nightly news, and even by word. The Google search engine allows people to simply look up the news websites in a matter of a second. The Google search engine has also been a substantial tool for students ranging from elementary school all the way up to college. It allows students to have access to countless amounts of resources for research purposes. The amount of information students have access to these days is unbelievable, and it has certainly aided students in essays, research projects, etc. This advanced search engine also allows students to have access to tutoring and learning websites like Khan Academy, Quizlet, and Kahoot. As the Google search engine continues to evolve in the future, the human culture will continue to change and adapt along with these advanced technologies. That was Media in the Making, brought to you by WJHS 91.5 The Eagle and the Eagle Tech Academy Mass Media Classes. Media in the Making aims to teach you about the evolution of media throughout history and its effects on culture. For more from the students, this podcast series will be on the WJHS 91.5 website, wjhs.org. Thank you for tuning in.